Thank you, thank you. How Hi. are you? How are you, Rosie? Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Now, I uh, briefly lived in your building. Did you have you know? to come back. I, I need do. you. You need me? I need you. Miss Lauren Nicole needs me. Badly. This is Very a good badly. day. No, now, I, I, was, I was always looking for you, searching for you. I know. Did I wish you'd found me. <laughs> this is so sweet. <laughs> Once I no, saw really. you, your car pull in, and you had all Snapple in your trunk. I know it. Are you a big Snapple I went fan? Through, yes, I went through a big Snapple phase. I find it's not so easy to find now. No. You know? Yeah. yeah. I go to the market, and I don't see a lot of Snapple. No. <laughs> So you took the car, I you see filled a lot of other things. You filled the whole trunk. I know, I know, I'm greedy. <laughs> I know. You are so wonderful in this new film, your new film, The Mirror Has Two Faces. Did you like it? I loved it. I, I absolutely it. loved it. Yeah. Not only is your performance brilliant, but you're stunning in the film, and you are stunning in real life. It's quite disarming. You are strikingly beautiful. Yes. I you just... are. I don't know if that's... <laughs> I just don't know what to say. Okay, I'm sorry. I will just... <laughs> <laughs> You're the best lines in that film. That's a funny line. It is. You were the greatest one-liner, zingers, the whole movie. What was it like working with Barbara Streisand? It was good. Yeah. She and I got along really well, and uh, we liked each other anyway. You knew her and before this film, I knew her, but not well. Mm -hmm. I mean, we didn't move in the same set, you know? Right. First of all, she lives in L.A., I live here. But um, she's terrific. She's quite amazing. I mean, in what she is able to do, that she is able to keep in her head all that stuff that has to do with directing. Right. Which has to do with knowing uh, what the set is like, you know, where the camera is, what the setup is, what the next thing that she needs, what she has shot before, whether it's going to cut in properly, whether she needs close-ups or long shots or medium shots or whatever. I mean, it really is a lot to keep in your head. I could never, ever do it. No, you have no interest in trying to do that? No. 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 It I is a lot of I want to be direct. Work. No, but I mean, you have to have a mind for that. Right. Because it's so tough. And was she demanding? She has the reputation of being demanding, but a lot of she that is... She is demanding. But I understand that. I'm demanding. Aren't you demanding? I'm don't, very don't you demanding. want the people that you work with to at least give as much as you do? Yes, you have a level of excellence you'd like right, everyone exactly, to try to achieve. Exactly. And she's like that, and I'm like that, so I understand that. I have great... Uh, I'm, I, I'm, I'm uh, totally in tune with that uh, point of view. Yeah, I think that's great. Right. No, it's important because, you know, there's, there is so much mediocrity now in mm -hmm. our world. Yes. And uh, it's such a blessing to have you on television now in the daytime. Oh, Miss Nicole! It's true. It's true. It's true. Now, I know that your real name is Betty, right? Yeah. Be oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> my, is my accent getting thicker? No, no. Because sometimes no, when I get nervous, no. it gets thicker. No. When I had I Sarah like Ferguson no. on, oh, The Duchess yes? of York, I said, I like you guys. <laughs> Ms. Bacall, what was I thinking it like? But now, who changed you? Did you change your name from Betty to Howard Lord? Hawks did. He liked it better. Don't ask me why. Howard Hawks had a fantasy. He had a whole fantasy life that he was going to be my Svengali and mold me. And he did. God, I mean, he, God, he was fabulous. But um, it didn't quite work out the way he intended. No. Because Mr. Bogart got in the way. Yes, Humphrey Bogart, of I, course. Uh, nobody God, messes but... around with him. No. I was reading a lot of the, um, well, we have all these magazines from, oh, from look at Harper's Bazaar oh. with you. <laughs> look at this on the cover of Life. See that? I know. Look at this. Can you get that one, too? That was and, the, the me that was. And still is. Pathetic. Now, you, you sort of stopped your career a little bit when you got married to, to Humphrey Bogart. Oh, Bogart. I did. Yes. I did. Well, that was, one, that was part of the deal. He had been married to three actresses, and he had seen what happens to a marriage when the actresses follow their careers and make that number one in their lives. And he said to me, he said, I love you, I will marry you, but not if a career is what you want more than anything, because I want a wife. So you have to make a choice. And I made the choice, and thank God I did, because uh, I had a great time for 11 and a half years. And then... No regrets. You know, no regrets. No regrets. Well, the movie, Mirror Has Two Faces, is open right now. There is talk of an Oscar for you. We don't no. want to jinx. I'm just no, saying, no, no, no. Ms. Bacall, I've heard it. Every review mentions it. I, have, I know, but you know something? I have never, ever been honored in this country by the motion picture business, and I certainly don't expect that to happen It's now. about to change. Mark my words. You will be nominated for this. It is an honor to have you here. Thank you so much for doing my show. It's over? That's eight minutes. That's it.
quick. That was eight minutes? Can you believe it? No. That was eight minutes. <laughs> you want to stay? No. You could stay. We got Emilio coming out. I just would, move over like Johnny used to I do. Would, I would if I could, but I have to go to the junket. The, ju the press junket. The press junket. The, the international time. press junket. Well, you have a good time. Right and if you me. happen to see Miss Barbara Streisand, yeah. you may mention that I'm sort of a fan of hers. Yes. Yes. <laughs> like you're on your knees. Exactly. <laughs> and if she would just walk in, say, my name is Barbara, walk out, I'd be happy. Like, just a crumb. Just tell her a crumb. I'll tell her. All right. I'll tell her. Ms. Lauren Bacall. Thank you. Come on next, Garth Thank, Thank you very you. much. Thank that you. was really good. Come to the Dakota. I would love to.